Hi, my name is Buck from Nemo Arms. I'm here in the Battle Wagon today to go over our adjustable gas block. Go over the settings, what the uses are, how to use the different settings, and to ask, answer some frequently asked questions about problems. First of all, our settings. You line your setting up that you desire with the arrow. So there's four, three, two, and one. When you're on four, that's full, that's wide open, that's full gas. Three is 58% gas, two is 44% gas, and one is 25% gas. The reason you'll you'll adjust that is depending on the rounds you use or if you're shooting suppressed or non-suppressed. This tends to get carbon built up on it as you're using it. As you're using your rifle throughout the day, if you'll push it in and turn it, just use it just like you're adjusting your just break it that carbon free and move it, that'll help. If it does get stuck, you'll want to use a small hammer and tap it in until it goes in. And if it won't turn then, use an Allen wrench. Once you get the Allen wrench in, when you turn it, only turn it clockwise. You do not want to turn it counterclockwise because it will take this screw, you'll back that screw out and it takes special tools and a lot of patience to get it back in. If you do need to knock the pin out to remove the to remove the knob, it's pretty simple. You want to make sure you push in, have it pushed in, and then just tap it out. It'll come out the bottom slot over here. There you have it. Then you can clean the carbon off. Clean the carbon off the best you can, scrape it off, clean it with a good cleaner, whatever you have to to get the carbon off. Then when you're ready to put it back in, just put it back with your number four setting lined up with your arrow. Make sure you push it all the way in. Line it up with the small hole inside. Tap it in. And take a pin to finish tapping it in. When you get here, you want to be careful because it's easy to drive it too far. Just drive it in until it's just inside the hole. Way to test. See if it'll turn. It won't turn there, so I gotta go a little bit farther. Now I can adjust it. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to use your owner's manual. Hopefully it'll answer most of your questions for you. If not, feel free to give us a call, shoot us an email. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, thanks.